Hello, hello, hello everyone. It's Cynthia Tolman, Ms. Flippy, your Gypsy Medicine Woman and your inspirational coach. Here to give you a reading for today for the collective. Let's see what the cards have to say. Woo, 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 woo. <laughs> what do they have to say? First card out oh, is something's coming in really fast. Fast movement. Fast, fast. Come on, baby. You can do it. Move on faster. We can go faster. Yeah, we can. <laughs> What's going in faster? And that's crystal clear. Something's coming in fast. And it's coming in fast. Is <laughs> a crystal clear answer. <laughs> I wonder what it is. I wonder what that is that's coming in fast. I wonder if the cards are. Let us know. Let us know. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Sometimes I get going. I don't know if I said this, Cynthia. Tell it. Miss Flippy, you're a gypsy medicine woman and your inspirational coach. Did I say all that already? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe if I did, I said it twice now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's how it works over here in the Gypsy Show. We're laying down. <laughs> What's coming in fast, crystal clear, laying things down to rest. Anything that's not working for you, anything that's not going in this higher vibrational story, you have laid that story down to rest. You're right away from it because you got this better direction to go. That better direction is a higher vibrational story. Oh my goodness, cards going down on the ground. <laughs> I'm telling you. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> it is about balancing having everything in balance in a solid balance so it's building up in this this nice precious precious order <laughs> it's, in, it's in a solid order it's in a solid order this cup of love love that you're sharing out with others sharing out with other people making sure that the old feelings are left down there behind so you can allow yourself to be grounded and whole and complete to allow that love story to come forward into your life to allow that love be in your life all the time <laughs> and let it be here all the time by releasing by releasing all those toxic ways by allowing uh, uh, us to shine the light on those old toxic ways so we can have our happy story this is the happiest card in the deck to shine that light upon those lower ways to be flipping that script around to this better script yeah 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 and so this divine masculine, he's full of unconditional love, unconditional love. He has nothing but love to offer. He really wants to bring the offering of love forward. And we have the highest priest. The highest priest knows things that we do not know. And sometimes she comes out and tells us what they are and sometimes not. But let's see why the highest priest showed up here right now in the reading right now today. Yes, see, let's see. Highest priest wants you to know <laughs> it is about loving yourself. It's about loving your soul. It's about loving all of you. Bare naked, stripped down to nothing that you love this body. You love this soul. You love <laughs> you love the part of you <laughs> that you're living in. <laughs> you're not out there somewhere. Your mind's not out there anywhere. It's in here loving that beautiful soul that you truly really are. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's it. Mm-hmm. So, whoa, whoa, what else the cards had to say for the collective today, besides laying down all those old feels and, and getting yourself grounded a whole and complete time, love, that love and that love and love life, your loving love story, spit it out, Cynthia, to let the love in your life come forward to be in your life on a regular basis. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And that is very crystal clear. The Divine Feminine has been working really hard at making sure that her inner self is in alignment with her outer self. And that one that's vibrant, that one that's whole, that one that's complete, that one that likes to be in balance with herself, balance with her Divine Masculine and the Divine Feminine within. So she can operate in this whole level. So she can operate being grounded, being whole, being complete, operating as a team player. Uh, where we the ground is solid the walls are building up in this most beautiful way the divine masculine he's been watching that divine feminine he's been he put his sword down because his thoughts have gotten crystal clear uh, meaning that they're not all caught up in the chaotic way they're not all caught up into all this chaotic way and when that divine masculine actually sees that the divine feminine goes hey i'm over here i'm right over here this is a divine couple this is a power couple these two they belong together and they are both single right now <laughs> we got the single couple in the house <laughs> yeah it hasn't been an easy journey it has been a little tough of a journey it has been a challenge but you know they they are finding their way to each other that divine masculine he is full of action full of passion full of desire and he wants to come forward with the younger feeling that younger feeling which has more um uh, enthusiasm in life you know 
with unconditional love having that unconditional love with a soulmate connection these two right here are a soulmate connection because they're the same sign that's a soulmate connection coming together with unconditional unconditional love it is because they've learned how to balance their emotions their low emotions and their higher emotions to allow them to have a balance within we have a lot of higher arcana cards also showing up in the reading that means divine divine is working really hard behind the scenes to uh, allow this shift to allow this change to happen um Let's see, let's see. To allow this movement, this fast, quick movement, it's like we're sliding right out of that lower vibrational field right into this higher vibrational field because you have chosen to live this higher vibrational story by flipping your script around to this better script. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 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 that's it. That's what you've done. That's what you've done. Mm -hmm. And this is the Divine Phenomenon. She is, the, she's the queen. <laughs> she's the queen of passion. She's the queen of desire. She's the queen that looks like she knows how to put on that peacock outfit and wear it quite well. <laughs> and that Divine Masculine, he's been watching her and he's been putting on his, his nice tuxedo outfit so he can look beautiful because he wants to see what's going on with that woman that's full of passion and desire because he's grounded. He's holding he's complete he might want to share his life with her <laughs> yeah 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 what else what else is going on for the collector right now here today what else what else mm, yeah he wants to, he wants to offer a cup of love <laughs> this divine masculine that solid whole complete he's rich you see he's got a lot you know he's well he's well grounded he wants to offer a cup of love from that playful kind of way <laughs> offer playful love <laughs> Yeah, who wants to offer a cup of love? Mm -hmm. Let's see what else we're collecting right now here today. What do cards have to say? What do cards have to say? Mm -hmm. Yep, yep, yep. It has been a journey. It has not been a straight line. We've had to weave our way in. We've had to weave our way out through this journey to to make some progress to be getting our stories out of that lower vibrational story into this higher vibrational story it wasn't a straight line it is it's something that we've had to bounce around in and we've had to play with we've had to see where this is taking us and where that is taking us mm -hmm. <laughs> and it has also been about guarding your story because other people want to come at you and say you can't do this we can keep you in that lower vibrational story and you're going no 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 i'm out here to play 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 i'm out here to go after victory i'm going after happiness i'm going after joy <laughs> i'm not going to stay in that lower vibrational story because i choose i choose to operate from my higher mindset no matter how much love i've given out i've always kept that cup of love for myself in paradise <laughs> that love is in paradise within my soul within my spirit within myself mm -hmm. that's what the cards are having to say it has a will of fortune change a will of fortune change is something that divine has as divinely crafted divinely created to allow this change to um, take place the change is for something better to getting out of the head taking the changes getting out of the head getting um so that we're not stuck in the thought process but we're operating more from the joyful process let's see let's see what else the cards have to say for the collective out here today i know we do a lot of thinking we do a lot of thinking but that should be changing when we're going into this higher vibrational story it is easier for us to get out of that thought process because it's a thought process that will take you under you know it is about flipping that script around to this better script so we can truly 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 be living and claiming a better life because of how we feel emotionally on the inside that is a wish it is a dream that's in the middle of coming true. it has not been a straight line it has not been a straight journey it has had its ups and downs to allow this wish and dream to come true so you are feeling whole so you are feeling complete within within this mind within this body and within the soul that you're living in right now today mm -hmm. Anything else for the collective? Anything, anything, anything else? This is divine. It's divine. Divine is calling. Divine is has been putting these new ways of thinking, this new mindset of a way into the picture so we can be operating from grounded, being grounded, being whole, being complete, being able to build our castle and being able to do it uh, um, in this um, divine way. <laughs> in the divine way. Mm. Anything else? Anything else? Mm -hmm. 
that's it for today it is you know just keep operating from your passion from your desire when you're operating from your passion your desire you can do this standing on one leg with your eyes closed because your light will always shine from the with inside from inside out to allow this brighter amazing story to come on forward this is cynthia toa miss flip it you're a gypsy medicine woman and your inspirational coach please remember to hit the like button hit the share button hit the subscribe button so you know when something's going to be posted next and it helps with all the algorithm stuff so it helps this kind of a channel stay around to be inspiring you guys to keep living your happier vibrational story of a life right now here today all we have is a now all we have to do is claim it now and then i do go live every monday and thursday nights at for at 9 30 p.m pacific standard time for your hidden love story and you can come on in and claim a free reading from me to you on the show as long as you're present and it is a random draw when i do the show uh, so if you're not you come in i take 22 numbers and then i do random draws from there just so you guys can learn how to live your happy ever after fairy tale dream of a story right here right now today <laughs> until next time have a beautiful day bye bye butterflies Ooh.